From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Alaska Day, Friday, October 18th, 2013. In the news, police and fire personnel from all over town responded last evening to a Cessna crash at the east gate of the Fairbanks International Airport. According to Angie Spear with FAI, all three occupants were taken to Fairbanks Memorial Hospital after the crash about 5.30 p.m. yesterday. One person died while the other two had what were described as serious but not life-threatening injuries. The aircraft apparently crashed on takeoff and came to rest about 300 yards off the runway. NTSB was on scene last night and no names have been released. We'll have additional details as they emerge. A Fairbanks man has been charged with felony sexual assault after allegedly raping an incapacitated woman in a downtown parking lot on Sunday. 52-year-old Leslie Aveogana of Fairbanks is in jail without bail for the assault. Aveogana is a registered sex offender and has a long-standing criminal record that includes previous felony sexual assaults and kidnapping. He was arraigned in Fairbanks District Court on Monday and will appear again in court on October 24th. And the state held a second hearing last night on proposed air quality regulations intended to reduce pollution in the interior. DEC officials say the regulations are aimed at balancing the need to meet federal air standards with residents' need to heat their homes. Two more hearings are scheduled, one next month and the other in January of 2014. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather for today. Mostly cloudy, scattered showers, areas of fog in the morning and highs in the upper 40s. Tonight, decreasing clouds, areas of fog, lows in the upper 20s to lower 30s. Then tomorrow, partly cloudy in the morning, mostly cloudy with scattered showers in the afternoon and highs in the mid to upper 40s. Extended outlook, mostly cloudy through Wednesday with gradual cooling. Highs in the 40s this weekend, 30s next week, lows dipping to the 20s and the aurora forecast is low. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. Remember, for more news, sports, or weather, you can download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching. Don't forget about CPR and enjoy your day.